Hi, thanks for watching. In this video, we are going to show how to set up PDF Ready Docs for SoftPro ProForm. Let's open up PDF Ready Docs. Let's get it to where we can see it in the video. When the main window comes up, we just click on Setup, and that takes us to the first setup screen. On this screen, we have the default save path for PDF documents. So that's the root path that documents will be saved in if we don't have it customized to save to your soft folder directories. And we have a list of documents that starts off with the state the document is good in and the document description. Let's start with the Alaska HUD with balance sheet document. We'll click on edit and that will open the ProUtil document set creation screen which works much like a ProForm document manager. We have a list of available documents on the left. We add them to our document set on the right. We can change where that document appears in that document set, that does affect the output order, and we can remove documents from the list. Down at the bottom of the screen, the first item is just an informative item. As you click on different documents that are already selected, the path to document in tree tells you what file this document really is. So this is the SoftPro ReadyDocs tree, HUD1 and closing, HUD1 documents, HUD1 legal, HUD1 legal page 2, settlement agent signature only. That is what this document is, and that we use this field to see the path to the original document. The name for document or group. This is the name as it appears to your users whenever they open PDF Ready Docs. The description name for the PDF attachments. This is the beginning of the file name as it's saved on the hard drive. So in this case, we would put the firm file number space HUD1, and then that will be followed by a date and time the document was created so that you always know when documents were created, what order they were created in. The final item to adjust on a document set is the state where that document is valid. You can select your state from the list, or you can select all states if you don't really care about states. If you're a single state operation, you'll just have all states. Uh, for multi-state operations, this is great because you can have different commitments for each state. And whenever you go into PDF Ready Docs, the user just sees commitment. They're just making a commitment. They don't really care at that point what state it is in. You've designed your system to select the correct state for them. Once you've made the adjustments so that you wish to make, you just click Save, and it will save it. This window will remind you that there are ch there are settings that still need saved with the save recommended. And we can save that and close it. And that pretty much covers setup for PDF Ready Docs. If you have any questions, feel free to send me an email. You can give me a call at 937-424-5734. Thanks again for watching. This is Dan Van Fleet. Stop by my blog at danvanfleet.com and see what I have to say about SoftPro and other things.